why do people stop us in the street almost and tell us that Margaret Thatcher isn't just inflexible, she's not just single-minded. On occasion, she's plain pig-headed and won't be told by Would anyone. Would you tell me who has stopped you in the street and said that? Ordinary Britons. Where? In conversation. But I thought you'd pubs. just come from Belize. Oh, this is not the first time we've been here. Will you tell me who and where and when? Ordinary Britons in restaurants, How in many? Cabs. How many? I would say at least one in two. I'm sorry, it's an expression I've never heard. Tell me who has said it to you, when These, and These are where. people that we meet in passing. But and we obviously raise the question of the, the state of their country with them. And they tell us, yes, we have a tough part, Prime Minister, but she's a little bit pig-headed. She won't be told by anybody. Isn't this interesting? Even the tone of voice you're using is changing from what you used earlier. When will you personally get to a point... Get to... <laughs> yes, bossy boots! <laughs> when will you personally get to a point where you say to yourself, that's it, I'm sick of this, I'm not recording, I'm not touring, I'm not doing a thing? I'm going to school with Brooke Shields. Perhaps you could give me one of your words of wisdom for each of these people. Pope Paul. He should be behind the bars. Mother Teresa. It is time for her to jump into a lake. The song and the phrase that people have attached to you most regularly probably is the times they are changing. Do you think that they have? I don't know. I have no idea. Did you think, did you think it would at the time? I would, I, you know, I had no idea of knowing. In the guerrilla war, nothing is certain. Originally, we were told we'd face about a five-hour walk to the guerrilla headquarters in the mountains of Mindanao. Well, that five-hour walk has turned into a three-day trek. And sometimes you yourself would be the executioner? Yes. How, how would you execute that man? We skewed the man like this. You're doing exactly... May I finish my question? No, right? and in fact, I think that you're going to keep on like this during the entire thing. And you you know what you're doing? Excuse me, I don't care to have this part filmed. You know what you're doing? Exactly what the men in the book do. And then you're going to say, you've been accused of man bashing. You're going to... You've been accused. Turn that thing off. Thank you, Mr. Casey. Don't worry about it, Ron. You'll see it in the ballot box, mate. We'll win. Oh. 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 If we were to put to air a story that was not flattering to you, what kind of action would you take there? Well, there have been many stories that have been put to air that are not flattering to us. Um, Sacked anyone? No, we haven't. Would you? And, no. No, I don't think so. And you are a television prostitute. It's a lot of charm, Mr Casey. I'm in a lot of charm. And there's a lot of bitch in you.